Hi guys, it's Melissa. I just wanted to post this because I was having some thoughts about the topic for this week as far as the decadence and the aestheticism. Um, one of the things I was thinking about actually has nothing to do with either, but as I was thinking about the metamorphosis, um, it brought to mind, I want to say kind of queer theory maybe, um, as far as uh, Gregor Samsa being basically in the closet for almost the entirety of the story and the family keeping him hidden like some deep dark secret. Um, so I was thinking along the lines of, um, sorry I'm trying to think of this on the fly, uh, I was thinking along the lines of staying in the closet and if that was something that uh, Kafka was trying to do on purpose as far as having that be a part of the symbolism as having him be the, the skeleton in the closet, the deep secret of the family. Um, but also the fact that the family felt this burden by him and they they felt so ashamed of him. It seemed very much like it wasn't just about him being a bug or an insect or whatever, but also the family could feel like that if somebody were not heterosexual or they might feel like that if somebody were um, not healthy, not physically um, normal, so to speak. Um, which is not to conflate the two, not to say that being other than heterosexual is the same as being not physically normal, but it's in in some respects there are similarities to how people before these progressive times were secretive about anybody who was other, anybody who was not um, what you would expect. So in the same way, and I know I've read stories about this sort of thing, um, and I can't think of a single one off the top of my head, but where there's a family member who might be supposedly crazy, they might be kept locked in a room and they don't come out and they don't talk about them, or it might be a family member who is not um, physically able, whether it's from some sort of deformity or some sort of congenital disease or epilepsy or any number of other things. But these are things that are also um, kept secret and almost f like the family feels shameful of that sort of thing. So that's what the metamorphosis was bringing to my mind today, was a combination of those thoughts. Um, and then towards the end when Gregor dies, spoiler alert by the way, um, but when Gregor dies and they, the family feels that there's an underlying sense of freedom that they feel and almost of elation, I really felt like that was more than just being free of the burden of this bug, but it could be symbolic of a family who's free of a family member who is not normal because they either leave of their own will or because they're forced to, or because they get sick and die, or any number of other reasons. Um, but it really just kind of brought to mind the complications that a family, not just then, but even now goes through when a family member comes out as being not what you expect, whether that's um, through their sexuality, their gender presentation, or health, or religion, or any number of other things. So that's one of the things I was thinking about, wanted to share with the class, and hopefully this hasn't been too rambly and um, all over the place. Thanks!